Watch till the end. Subscribe to this channel. How to generate a mandate form or a mandate number and a PIN. And some few errors and how to go about it. So all the procedure, it's in the video. How to assess your portal and generate. All the procedure is in the video. But let's look at the descriptions and before we go to the main steps on generating the mandate number and the pin to generate your mandate number and the pin first you go to your epaisley portal you click to, to login after login you select generate mandate form click on new mandate form details will be sent to your to your phone or sms and the number will be something like 70CD61234567, something like that. That will be your mandate number. And then there will be another mandate, uh, PIN code. Another code, which is an OTP, uh, something like 5231, uh, uh, something like that, will be sent to you. You must not give this code to anyone except for official use where you want to use it to acquire your loan or use it to acquire an insurance or use it for the purpose you intend do not give that code to anyone all right which error codes have we or errors have we found that we want to clarify right there are some few complaints that have come to our attention that generating the mandate form um, it's all right, it's successful, but the OTP or the SMS is not coming, no matter how you try, right? If your network is not good, your network is not good, the SMS is not going to come. Even when you are generating a new form or the one-time PIN code, if your network is not good, this is not going to come or it's not going to work. So your network must be good before you do that. Now, if upon all trials it fails, this is what you have to do. Every district or every region have a controller office. The office is aware of some of these errors and how they know how to solve it. All you have to do is go to your district controller office or regional controller office. Mostly, they are in the same building with the GES. Enter the office in charge of the E pay sleep portal. There are different offices and they have different functions. If you enter any of them, they will still redirect you to the main office. Some are about loans, some they only work on the e pay sleep portal. So go to the office where they work on the e pay sleep portal. Tell them that you are generating a mandate form, form and then you are, your SMS is not coming. Immediately you tell them this. They will take your your password and staff ID, log into their system, and generate the code for you. This is the best way. Do not call anyone on WhatsApp or on Telegram to do this for you, and they will ask you for the OTP and the number and so many other things. You will find yourself wanting later. Do not, under any circumstance, call anyone on WhatsApp, on Facebook, on Twitter, even us, seekersnewsgh.com, don't call us. Go to the main office for your issue to be resolved. All right. Below is all the procedure video on how to access the portal and generate and where to click. Steps in generating a mandate form or a mandate number and pin so go to your web browser or URL so Google Chrome for example and click on it on the search bar go to Google and search ePaySleep or PaySleep the first one is usually it then you have this pop-up that will come as a warning from the controller and accountant general department note that the controller and accountant general is not liable for any financial loss resulting from disclosing your employee details including password to third parties so if you 
give your password and details to the public and they know and they hack you or whatever happened to your business it is not their fault all right so he pay sleep here you enter your employee number enter your password and then you enter your the code then you click to show that you are not a robot most of you do the mistake of using a relative phone number or details to register your payslip never do that if you have done that kindly write a letter to the your head your head will add a cover letter to it send it to the nearest controller office at your district or in your region they will reset the password the the portal for you after the reset you can now go and see the validator in your school for a new portal to be created for you using only your credentials don't say i did not warn you subscribe to this my channel and you know more so enter your details i'm not entering my details for you to see or anybody's details for you to see so enter your details immediately you enter your password and the code the main dashboard will open e pay sleep so you can see my pay sleep my supplementary pay sleep messages so you can send message to the controller directly if you have issues with your salary you can change password not active you need a letter to do that or, or you can change your password but generate mandate form change of association form which you can easily do on this platform then generate mandate form here is it so what you do is that you click on it to generate mandate form immediately you click on it you will see a new mandate number so you click on it a pop-up will ask you whether you are sure you want to generate a new mandate form so you can proceed to say yes that you want to generate a new one it will load so a new mandate form will be generated for you you can click at the top right corner to you can click at the top right corner um top left sorry corner to print this mandate form note that immediately you click on generate a number sms will be sent to you and an sms will be sent to you directly including an otp and this number do not give the otp number to anybody no matter what do not give the otp number to anybody so all your details will show from this level all right so down there you see here i do hereby give my consent to the third party company to assess my personal and pay slip information for purposes of financial transactions and the consideration gag is electronically notified of this mandate per mandate number and the number will be attached to to wait for you kindly subscribe to our channel so go to the office and let them resolve your problems for you if, if you can't even access your epay sleep portal you need to go to the office and they'll work on it for you avoid contacting people on whatsapp to do the thing for you we know what you are talking about Kindly subscribe to our channel and you get to know more about this. Note that if somebody is forcing you to go and take loan for them that they will pay later, please do not do it. Many have fallen victim. Subscribe to our channel.